Phyllis here. Hey guys, it's Phyllis. Welcome back to my channel. And today is Saturday, February 3rd. And I weighed in today. And every Tuesday, I upload my um, weekly weigh-ins. Did I lose any weight, gain any weight, or did I stay the same? Check out the uh, video Tuesday. Um, I uh, been kind of scrambling around this morning. I needed to take my dog to the groomer, and I went to Target. I was looking for some new foo finds, and um, it was a scan in full. So I lost track of time. I wanted to take a picture or do a little a video of Jacada, what she looked like before she went to the groomer, because she looks completely different after she gets her hair cut. She looks like a big fur ball. Um, before and then she looks like she's this big uh, when she gets back. So I am on my way to Earth Fair um, It is a local grocery store. I believe it is all organic um, It just opened up down the street for me. It's a little bit of a dupe of um, Trader Joe's and Whole Foods and supposedly it's supposed to be a little bit cheaper and I am on I'm hoping that what I'm looking for um, as far as new food finds, we'll be there. It's not at Target. So, the two things I was looking for are not at Target. So, come along with me, guys. Bye. I just went to um, Home Goods dumpster and then I went to the Alta dumpster. There wasn't anything in there. Um, what time is it? Hold on. Let me see what time it is. Uh, it's almost 1130. I just came out of Wayfair and I tried to record in there, but they told me no. Um, it is a really cool grocery store, um, but it is completely and utterly it's not utterly. It's out of my price range, to be honest with you. Um, I I don't get the the price range on food that's you know organic or you know gluten free. You know there may be a few more steps in the process, but I just don't understand why our food is not made like that normally. That you have to pay a higher price for a better quality food. I don't get that. So um, I was when I was looking around in there at the produce, and I'm like, you know, I could go to Publix and get that stuff. You know, two or three. You know, sometimes four dollars cheaper. And I just I couldn't get myself to to do the grocery shopping in there. Um, I did look for the food finds that I wanted, and they weren't in there. So I don't know. I think I don't know if I'm discouraged or I'm just shocked at the price. But I did pick up um, uh, two things um, because I've been wanting to try them. Um, this is the Earth Fair Norwegian Steelhead. Um, it's I guess it's a fish. This is. How many ounces? I, I believe this is, oh, it's six ounces. This was uh, $3 for that big piece of fish. So if I had to do a comparison, it's bigger than my palm. Um, I, th there's somebody on Instagram that I followed that um, eats that. And, and I haven't been able to find steelhead trout. Maybe it's trout. It's a fish. But um, that's, the, and they were $3 a piece, so I bought two of them. So those were only two things I bought there because that was like in my budget. But um, 
Anyway, I'm glad I came up here and experienced it. I will just continue to keep shopping at, you know, Publix and, you know, occasionally go to Walmart and uh, probably go to Walmart and get my ground chicken there. But I'm just, I'm shocked at that. So, bye. look who I just picked up from the groomers. I wish I would have filmed what she looked like before um, I took her in to see Tara, but um, she looks so good. Tara, Jakeda, hi girl. Look at you, she's smelling the fish. You doing all right? You look so small. You look so pretty, girl. You look so pretty. Say hi. You looking good? You feel probably a million, like a million dollars. Huh? You look Tuesday, February 6th, and, and it is about 4.20 in the afternoon. I just got off work, literally went in my house, changed my clothes, got back into my car. I am on my way to see my friend, my hairdresser, Danny, so she can cut and color my hair. So I just want to take you guys along with me. There's my hairdresser, come here. Oh, oh God. There she is, there's my hairdresser. <laughs> she went across the street to get something to drink. I got down here to the salon a little bit early. <laughs> We're going in, you guys. This is where I'm going. I'm gonna step back a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, I am down here in St. Petersburg at the Intuition Salon and Spa, and this is my friend, my hairdresser, 
Danny. Hi. Say hi, Danny. And um, when I lost about 25, 30 pounds, my whole entire look changed and I wanted a new hairstyle. And one thing I know about Danny is this I'm sorry if I'm wiggling a little bit, is that she is an artist at heart. Um, I th how old are you now? 27. She's 27, but I have known her since she's been about 17 or 18 years old. I knew her when she was in beauty school and when she graduated, and I've had many, many years to um, watch her grow as a hairdresser and seen so many people get her their hair done by her. And I knew when I needed to make a change from going, uh, having long hair to short hair, I trusted Danny to make that change for me and not only that um, I needed a, like a different hair color so what I did is um, I got a picture and some hair color and a picture of a, a woman with a hair color I wanted mm -hmm. and I made a appointment to see Danny mm -hmm. and you did a consult <laughs> with me didn't you yep and how long was the consult about 15, 20 minutes. And what she did is she asked me a bazillion questions. Mm -hmm. It was so thorough. I never had a consult like that. I don't think I've ever really had a consult. Oh, it's only two pages, but it is it is in depth. Yeah, yeah, it is. So I showed her the picture, and you told me, I think I can do your hair like that. I well, said, I know I can. I know, yeah, <laughs> which is true. And then we talked about my hair color and, you know, if it, if it if my hair was dry, frizzy, all the products that I used. And then what she did is you recommended, like, salon products for me to use yeah. if, I, if I chose to use those. Mm -hmm. So one thing I will say about Danny is this. <laughs> she is an artist at heart. She is young. She is talented. She is creative. And not only does she do really good hair, you also sing. So I'm not sure why she's just not cheesing in the camera because you stand in front of hundreds if not thousands of people and sing, don't you? <laughs> yeah. yeah, she does. Don't let her fool you. She is super talented. So um, I'm just going to take you guys along with me. We're going to go back over there to the station and you're going to do my hair. Yep. All right. Okay. Say bye. Bye. I'm going to sit under here for like 10 minutes now. Um, we did change the color. Um, I asked her to go a little bit more um, copper, nutmeg, cinnamon, a little bit warmer brown because I've been doing Auburn, which is a beautiful color. I mean, um, I was able to go like eight weeks um, in between my last color till now. Um, so the, the hair color that she uses here is super good. It's long wearing and it doesn't fade really bad. So um, I'm curious to see how this is gonna turn out. We're just gonna warm it up. And she told me that it may take a couple um, colors to get it exactly where we want it, but I trust her with my hair. So 10 minutes, hi. All right, you guys, I am still waiting to get my hair rinsed. You can see the color. It just came out from underneath the dryer, but here is the salon. This is downtown St. Pete. I like this salon down here. We got some, somebody local, I believe, painted that. It's cool, local artists. 
There's me. There's my hairdresser right there. She's talking to a client. So this is it, you guys. It's just got a really cool vibe down here. I'm waiting for Danny to come back in here. I've been playing some Toy Blast. I forgot to spin the wheel. Hey girl! Let's We're gonna go wash hair. my hair. No! <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, this is the final product. Oh, yeah, we'll get your head in there, too. She did a great job on the cut and color. If you guys are looking for a new stylist, put your face up there. This is Danny. She is at the institution's <laughs> Intuition Salon and Spa. We have Clearwater, St. Pete, and now Largo and Bel Air. Right. <laughs> and she will give you how much money off if you are a client for the first time how much do you of a discount do you give a new client twenty five dollars off fifty dollars or more so there you guys go in the description box below i will put a link to the salon and you can contact danny if you're in the clearwater largo seminole st pete tampa area <laughs> This is your girl. I've done all the research for you. <laughs> great color, great cut, great atmosphere. And wow. she is truly an artist at heart. I do appreciate you. I do think Thanks. you are completely amazing. And I am glad that not only are you my stylist, that you are my friend. So thanks you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys later. Yeah, bye, bye guys. <laughs>